If you can't watch, we'll bring you live updates throughout the trial on Kebbeland.com. Plus, we're going to have the latest on the trial on Kebbeland News beginning tomorrow on Midday in Kebbeland. Well, in today's world of technology, threats to a person or business's cybersecurity are quite common. It's why Dakota State University wants to teach middle schoolers how to stay safe on the Internet. DSU also wants to encourage young girls to consider a career in the industry. Kebbeland's Lauren Solik explains how they do that at the annual CyberHer Security Camp. 125 middle school girls from across the country are at Dakota State University this week to get a valuable education about the cyber world. One of my favorite classes was probably the fishing class when we learned how to like fake someone to, into giving us information. Python code and just like working with computers and stuff is really fun to do. The seventh annual Gen Cyber Girls in Cyber Security Camp opened with a speech from Bridget Bean, an assistant director at the Cyber Security and Infrastructure Security Agency. In that speech, Bean pointed out that only 24% of the nation's cyber security workers are women. What you are doing together here this week is important for you today and it's important for our nation. It was really inspirational because even if just only like one of us out of everyone here went into cyber when they were older, I mean it would still affect it and it could inspire more people later to then join. Though some of these girls may not go on to become cyber experts as adults, what they learned this week will still be important for years to come. Just being able to understand the technology gives you a better chance to make decisions about what you're doing in your everyday life. I definitely think since the world is definitely going more towards the internet base and just like more computers, I think it's definitely important that we educate ourselves. In Madison, Lauren Solik, Kelloland News. Well, throughout the week, the cyber or the girls at the cyber camp will learn things like cyber forensic programming and crypto cryptography. And if you would like to learn more about DSU's mission with this camp, follow the link under the story on kettleland.com.